We are in the Firinaki Forest Park today, southeast of Rotorua and kind of directly straight east from Taupo. And we are going to be exploring this beautiful treasure, this wonderful hidden gem that I don't think a lot of people come out and explore. There's actually a free dock campground here, the Sanctuary Campground, although on the New Zealand Taupo map it's spelled wrong. It's spelled Sanctuary, no C. It's a little bit south of this small village, Minganui, and beautiful old growth forest here. We're going to be diving in and see what they have, what sort of hidden treasures await us here in Firinaki. So we just drove into this main car park area for the Firinaki forest area. Massive trees everywhere. The kahikatea, the, the white pine trees, which are the tallest trees in New Zealand. And I read that a naturalist once described the Firinaki forest as, as a dinosaur forest because it's just such a massive ancient forest and it is some of the oldest and most impressive forest in all of New Zealand and it is truly spectacular. I'm excited to dive in. There's waterfalls and and beautiful walking tracks. There's a several multi-day um, circuit you can do with huts and and just wow I'm totally blown away. There's only one other car at the parking lot. And there's a beautiful canyon here. I don't think I can pronounce the name but a on the way to Firinaki Falls, you get a glimpse of this beautiful canyon. Hopefully, we can get a bit more up close and personal with it. So this canyon is one of the first pictures I saw of Firinaki. And I saw a beautiful picture of this narrow little gorge canyon. And I said to myself, I definitely have to check that place out. It's moving pretty quick. I'm gonna try and go back up in there a little bit with the GoPro and get a much more up close personal shot of this beautiful gorge. Oh man, it's pretty deep right here. <laughs> so I'm wearing long pants instead of my bathing suit because the sand flies were really bad at the campsite this morning. So I wanted the long pants to cover my ankles. But this gets really deep.
Wow, this is amazing. Wow, oh, there's the bridge. through these massive trees. We just saw a massive Rimu tree. You can definitely see why it has been referred to as a dinosaur forest. This primitive, ancient, massive forest was actually preserved in large part due to Sir Edmund Hillary, the first guy to climb Mount Everest. They were actively trying to prevent the logging and destruction of this area. And finally, in 1984, New Zealand turned this into a, a forest park and it's a special ecological zone that has worldwide significance actually for the amount and size of these podocarps, which podocarps are uh, cone bearing trees. So you know like a pine cone, anything that bears a cone is what's known as a podocarp. strong current here at the top of Firinaki Falls. Probably wouldn't recommend having kids swim here. Looks like a nice swimming hole below this, but I don't know if there's easy access to get down there. Nice little swimming hole grotto at the top of it. But this river, if you keep going upstream, lots of little beautiful little nooks and crannies to just take a quick swim. Beautiful vegetation and, and mossy rocks and digging the vibe. And the, the loop track actually goes across this bridge. So there's a bridge right above it and it loops back around to the parking lot. Firinaki Forest, I love this place. Definitely off the beaten path and so much possibility. You can do a multi-day tramping track here and there's another waterfall. There's actually, I think, a few more waterfalls. Just epic, epic day out here in Firinaki. Infamous.